le monde, ou en anglais, le mouth. Un extraordinaire endroit sur la côte Cape coast de Southern Africa. I have been coming here since I can remember, and the old man has been coming here for decades. He is obsessed. Why? It's a pristine wilderness, filled with expectation, amazing wildlife, and you know something is going to happen. There's that sense of expectation, scanning the lagoon and waiting for the tide to push. That's when the grunter enter the flats to feed. There are large creatures that enter this lagoon, and I remember as a small boy, the first time a huge ray approached me more than two meters wide. It was visible as just a huge dark object under the surface, and one I hoped did not want. Their eyesight, so acute, that one can only use a very light tackle and playing these powerful fish will test your skill as a fisherman every time. As powerful as these fish are, there are other species that enter this lagoon, and we know that some are much larger and can even exceed 100 kilograms. Big one at Demont is a once-in-a-lifetime fish. If you are not prepared, it is an experience that you will regret for the rest of your life. Okay, let's see him. Hold him up. for the camera. Is that a face a mother could only love? Check these out, folks. Radical. And he calls himself a fisherman. Scary stuff. Day two breaks with that magic in the air. That sense of anticipation. And one has to stop oneself from running to the water. There is a whole day ahead. Could this be the day? Suddenly it's electric. The tide starts moving and the large blue shapes appear from the deep water channel onto the flats, then disappear back into the channel of blue as fast as they arrived. The fish are coming. The day has chosen Conolith and the big one hits. The adrenaline rush so powerful he is rendered silent. It's not a grunter. It's something way faster and more powerful. Because of the distance between us, we only notice the fight taking place 15 minutes in. How many times he run you out now? Is he running you out again? A fight that will take hours and test his skill as a fisherman, as he knows that he has hooked that fish you only hook once in a lifetime. The dark shape beneath the surface teases him as it uses the current of the tide to resist the pull of the rod.
Finally, the fish tires, and as it enters the shallows, it is a steambrass, a formidable fighting fish. And the fisherman knows there will be many others in the future, but none like this.